Okay, this is part two of the um, Reason Record um, du Duo. This is um, you know, about to pretty much explain briefly on Reason uh, 5 and Record 1.5. Um, that's what um, just came out. And I um, also have um, the Recycle 2.1. What you're looking at here is the Recycle 2.1. Uh, right now, you know, just because uh, I have, I'm going to put out a short video, probably put in, like, parts, I'll just go ahead and pretty much show you the workflow, you know, once again, I, you know, not really a, a pro at it or anything, I'm just a person who's real fascinated about the, um, the software, you know, I've been trying to get it for years, and finally I got it, and I thought it was pretty cool, you know. Uh, can't wait to get the tutorial, you know, for this so I can understand this even more. But at least I did the tutorial for the um, the recycle 2.1, and um, you know, I think this thing is unbelievable. But um, you know, like on the first part, I was trying to get the the temple and stuff back like that. Somehow, I just you know, just still trying to figure out how to do it. But I think I pretty much got it. But anyway. Um, yeah, this is what it sound like when you have a slow tempo here. Kind of had that little delay there. Well, just what it's doing is it's going through slice, slice by slice. And I bumped this up right now. I bumped this up to like 120 BPM. 116, 120. The original tempo, they even show you the original uh, tempo, which is 91.020 BPM. Now, right now, it kind of sounds so choppy and all that. Let's see, let's try to follow this thing. I don't know if you can see the line. But, yeah, it's, it's going through each. Year. Like each slice, if you, you can see real closely, you have um, like black lines. You know, um, I use the, the sensitivity to at least find the basic lines, but you can also manually uh, put the lines in. Well, you know, the lines called a slice, so I'm gonna, that's what I want to say a slice on this. So. But if I just go ahead and toggle this, it'll like go through whatever slice I want to go to. Yeah. But um the cool thing about this is uh like the tempo. Um when you had the tempo like uh, up like this one, um Pretty higher, you got a higher tempo in the sample than normal, you know, the original. So it kind of sounds a little choppy or whatever. That's when the, um, like the, what's this? The stretch comes in. It's got the stretch. Lower the stretch to make it sound more of a, um, Make it sound more of like like it's blending in, you know. Um, you can still have the high tempo, but it won't change the um, sound at all. So it's kind of blending a little bit on that. And then you also have your decay. Tacking K's and the uh, tacking the DK's and all that to make it kind of sound like it's, um, you know, like stretching here or fade a little bit or, you know, it, anything that helps you to blend in with the, um, make the music perfectly blend or exactly the way you want it, you know, so it kind of makes it sound like it haven't changed, but it's a slower or higher tempo or whatever. I can also 
also like right here I can add manually add a pencil mark there. And the idea of this is uh, whenever you see like a uh, like like these um, these peaks right here, you gotta like if if the um, the sensitivity is not catching these, well it, it'll catch if it, if you bump it high enough, but it'll probably catch some unnecessary um, line, you know, like slices. Then put some unnecessary slices in there. But um, more likely, if you kind of get the idea of uh, have most of it in, you know, like the slices in, except very few that I think this this one might need a slice. I don't have a slice in that one yet, or you know, like that one. You know, this this little thing right there. So I'm gonna add mainly add probably like this slice here in this slice. There you go. Now, I can just go ahead and uh, play it. And you can also do the equal lot, like make the beats harder. You know, like, well, well, a lot of bass tremble and stuff like that. You can adjust the equalize on that. And you can cut that on. Or you can cut the uh, threshold, you know, things like that. So that's pretty much basically it. Um, yeah, you can pretty much do, you know, like just basically um, a basic loop with, and you slice it up um, to pretty much pieces. But good thing about it is you can still keep the uh, the original like song. You just copy. Um, to this drive and um, and it's just just um you know I mean it just don't mess up the sound I mean it just don't mess up the original I mean you can just have this right here and uh, you can still keep the original just in case if you mess this up yeah, if you mess this up, it's, it's like it's no, you know, it's like, oh, no, you know, like, I totally screwed up, you know, to the point it's like, damn, I got to put in a CD and, or, you know, download, you have to re-download, you know, the song and all that again. So, but, yeah, that's basically it. But like I said, I'm not, a, I'm not a person, I'm not a pro or anything, I'm just, you know, I'm not, I'm not like, Following a script, as you can see, I just all I'm showing you is basically, you know, like, well, this is what it looks like, and this is the basic workflow. You know, that's basically it. That's all I'm gonna show you. I'm not really a professional or anything. So, but you know, anyway, uh, seems like I got pretty good slices. So I'll just go ahead and save it. And when you save this, you know, normally it'll save into a Rex file. You can also, like, um, in order to, it's a Rex file that is exclusively to import, uh, like, to use the uh, doc, Dr. Octo Rex on the Reason 5 software part of it. But, but it, it, you can also uh, export the files into pretty much um, anything you know, else. Um, I think MT3s is not really a um, thing that you um, that it will export. Uh, but I, you know, you probably get like another cheap software that, like the Forge, the Sony Forge. I can just take this piece and you know, like. Um, copy it and paste it on the other, you know, program. But, you know, that's pretty much all I can do on that. But anyway, let's um, go ahead and close this and um, we'll go to Reason 5 and pull this up and, and